Odie Loke Sports Info here, back with another vid for you guys. Yeah, y'all, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell icon so y'all can be notified of this real because y'all know Odie Loke keeps it real. So, yeah, y'all, let's get into this vid. So, Bob Arum, he has came out with some statements, right? And he basically saying that Al Heyman is telling his fighters not to mess with the white guys, right? Not to mess with the white guys. Right? But really, Bob is talking about the LDBC. Right? He's talking about Al Heyman and the LDBC. Because these guys make hundreds of videos. Right? Telling black fighters not to mess with the white guy. Hundreds of videos. So Bob, he didn't stumbled up on one of these videos, right? On a, on 50 or 60 of these videos, right? They even tell his fighter to leave him and go and sign with Al Heyman, <laughs> right? So what Bob Arum was saying, it wasn't a lie. Did he lie? Did he lie? When... These guys are telling his fighter, Terrence Bud Crawford, to leave him and come to the PBC, right? So Bob Arum is not lying. But the funny thing to me is, is that the LDBC, they got the nerve, right? They got the gall to try to be mad, to try to be upset. This comment, I didn't even take this comment as a racist comment. I took it as the truth. Right? Because the LDBC, think about this. These guys are 95, no, 100% black males. 100% black males, right? Some, no, 98% black males because they do have some females in the LDBC. Right? But these guys find a way, right? They black. But they find a way to shit on another black fighter. Right? They call AJ a slave. He's a coon. He's a dog. Right? He's a token boy. Right? Right? He on PEDs. He gay. He this. He that. Right? Now they on Bud Crawford, which I've been told, y'all, the video is still up there. I put up this video last year when they first started talking about this. I put it up. I told y'all the LDBC is going to turn this into some racist bullshit between two black fighters. Like they always do. Like they always do. Y'all don't get it yet. Y'all don't get it yet. They always do these things. And it's not going to never stop because they want super chats. They want subs. They want likes. And the only way to keep y'all coming back to their channel and giving them that is to bullshit y'all around and not give y'all the truth. That's the only way. That's the only way to get y'all back to their channels. To bullshit, bullshit y'all around. Play with y'all minds so y'all can keep on giving them super chats, right, and likes and subs. Hey, there's nothing wrong with it. To each his own. To each his own. But you're being played like a fool, right? Man, you see a fool bump a fool head. For real. So, Bob Arum spoke the truth. He spoke the truth. The LDBC is a cult of hypocrites, of dudes who do not love boxing, period. These guys don't love boxing like we do, people. They want your money. They want you to uh, uh, subscribe to their channels. They want your likes. They want you to go to their Patreon, pay a dollar a month. Y'all don't get it? Man, it's ridiculous. But Bob was right.
Yeah. Uh-huh.